Number 10. Blue Marlin. It does not seem to be possible for a ship to transport cargo of 75,000 tons in only one voyage. However, Blue Marlin, a cargo ship owned by the company Dockwise, can transport oil platforms, aircraft carriers, and even other cargo ships through the seas on the planet. The big size of this ship is impressive. It is 225 meters long, 47 meters in depth, and its main deck is equal to the size of two soccer fields. To start this massive ship, multiple diesel engines of 70,000 horse are needed to cross the seas at a speed of 13 knots. This ship has been used to transport cargo of very heavy weight, including transporting the military vessels such as USS Cole and an Australian aircraft carrier. This isn't even close to the biggest cargo that Blue Marlin has transported, though. This ship was employed to transport the biggest offshore oil platform in the world from Korea to the Gulf of Mexico. Number 9. Vanguard This ship was built in the Hyundai Korean shipyards, and it's the biggest heavy lift ship in the world. It's even larger than the ship Blue Marlin as it has an overall length of 275 meters and a beam of almost 80. Ship's diesel propulsion plant provides 27 megawatts of power for smooth and flexible operations. And Ship's electric plant has two diesel generators with six inline cylinders that can produce 4,350 kilowatts, two 12-cylinder V diesel generators with the capacity to generate 8,700 kilowatts, and one diesel generator that can produce 1,200 kilowatts. To be able to transport such heavy cargo, both ships Blue Marlin and Vanguard have a special feature. They can submerge 13 meters in the water, filling their tanks with water, which allows them to carry other ships or floating structures. When the cargo is on the deck, the ship's tanks empty, and their decks are raised back over the water surface. Number 8. Nimitz These ships are the best aircraft carriers, which have a full load displacement of over 97,000 tons, and are the largest warships of their kind in the world. The first ship, Nimitz, was deployed in 1975, while the tenth ship and the last of this class, named George H.W. Bush, was commissioned in 2009. This kind of aircraft carrier has a service life of over 50 years, and they require just one midlife overhaul. This super aircraft carrier with an overall length of 332.8 meters and a beam of 77 meters has a 4.5-acre flight deck, and it can carry 90 fighter planes. These ships tower 20 stories above the water and can accommodate 3,000 to 3,200 crew members, 1,500 air crew members, and another 500 people who are in charge of operating these war giants. Number 7. Oasis of the Seas A company, Royal Caribbean, hired more than 500 naval engineers to construct this massive cruise ship in just three years. This ship also combines luxury and comfort for tourists. It has small-scale ship models, stairs, elevators, mirrors, and an incredible collection of works of art, with more than 7,000 paintings by international artists. This ship is 17 floors high, 361 meters long, and weighs more than 225,000 tons. Hence, it can accommodate around 6,300 passengers, without including the 2,160 crew. Oasis of the Seas is also provided with the latest technology, remarkable engineering, developments, and naval construction. The ship can purify its water and can retract its funnels when going under bridges. During construction, 25,000 square meters of steel, 5,000 kilometers of cable, and 600,000 liters of paint was needed to build it. This ship is a real giant of the seas. It's equipped with 2,700 exclusive suites, energy generators, fresh water and sewage plants, an outdoor amphitheater at the stern, a swimming pool with a water wave simulator and walls made of artificial rocks to practice rock climbing. Number 6. CSCL Globe In December 2014, the ship CSCL Globe with the capacity to transport 19,000 100 standard-sized containers, owned by the company China Shipping Container Lines, became the largest container ship in the world. This mega ship is as large as four soccer fields of 100 meters each. 
The ship owner company has declared that this massive ship has an overall length of 400 meters and a beam of 60 meters. This huge cargo ship, which the company ordered from South Korean shipyards, can carry 19,100 standard-sized containers. And if you put all the containers in a stacked-up manner, they could form a container mountain five times higher than Mount Everest. Likewise, this container ship can transport 200 million electronic tablets in only one voyage. Number 5. CMACGM this massive ship, which has an overall length of 396 meters, a beam of 54 meters, and a draft of 16 meters, was considered as one of the largest container ships around the world. But nowadays, its owning company also has other bigger container ships, and other important shipping companies keep developing and launching massive ships to navigate the oceans. The company owning this giant ship that can transport 16,000 containers is implementing cutting-edge technology and bigger equipment to follow the current trend in the shipping industry. Number 4. MSC Oscar There is a tough race among the container ship manufacturers to get the honorable title for the biggest container ship in the world. The previous ship, CSCL Globe, was the biggest container ship in the world for only two months. As of January 14, 2015, the ship MSC Oscar was launched. Shockingly, this ship is 5 meters shorter than CSCL Globe, even after it beats the CSCL Globe because it is slightly better regarding cargo capacity, which can transport 19,224 containers. It has a total deadweight tonnage of 197,362 DWT and double hull to give extra resistance during the worst meteorological conditions, even if it is fully loaded. The ship's superstructure is located at the center of the ship's overall length. Moreover, it has space to accommodate 30 people. The propulsion plant of the ship can generate 16 megawatts of power and move the 10-meter propeller with five blades that makes the ship navigate at a speed of 22.8 knots, with an operating range of more than 42 kilometers. Number 3. Emma Maersk The Emma Maersk was the first ship of the Maersk class as well as the biggest container ship in the world in 2006 when it was launched. The engineers of the company Maersk built a total of eight ships of this class in Denmark shipyards exclusively for a client during the period of 2006 to 2008. This kind of ship has a deadweight tonnage of 160,000 DWT, an overall length of 397.71 meters and a beam of 57 meters. They can also transport 14,770 containers. These container ships are propelled by a 14-cylinder engine that can generate a continuous power over 80,000 kilowatts at 102 RPM, which allows the ship to reach service speeds of 25.3 knots, which is the equivalent of 50 kilometers per hour on land. Number 2. Mollermersk this huge ship is currently the second largest container ship in the world. It has a cargo capacity of 18,270 containers. This kind of ship has a deadweight tonnage of 165,000 DWT, an overall length of 399 meters, a beam of 59 meters, and a draft of 14.5 meters. There are 20 ships of this class navigating the oceans on the planet. These big colossal structures are propelled by an integrated system with two engines of 30,000 kilowatts each and two propellers. The heat recovery system of the ship saves approximately 10% of energy consumption by the main engine. It is also known that this kind of ship lowers carbon dioxide emissions per container by 20% in comparison with former container ships. Number 1. Prelude FLNG the company Shell collaborated with Technip and Samsung and announced its last project, Prelude. Actually, they wanted to build the biggest floating object in the world. This ship is designed to extract 110,000 oil barrels daily. It's being built with more than 260,000 metric tons of steel, which is approximately four times more steel than the one needed to build the Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco. Ship Prelude is 488 meters long, 74 meters wide, and it weighs 600,000 tons. 
It's designed in such a way that it's prepared for bad meteorological conditions and it will be able to process and keep the value of the extracted natural gas. Moreover, this ship is propelled by engines of 6,700 horsepower and can even withstand Category 5 hurricanes. This facility will allow the exploration of new energy sources offshore and will be processing around 3.6 million tons of liquefied natural gas per year, aiming to be prepared for the future's growing demands.